Hey y'all, I am Luna Ray Star Goddess and I'm here to do your Leo July reading. This reading can apply to your sun, moon, rising, Venus, signs, north node, or if you cross watching for a Leo. Personal readings are available. Email me at divinelygoddy2 at gmail.com. Check out my course, Learn to Roll for Beginners. It's on udemy.com. One card flew out. Everything will be down in the description box below this reading. So let's jump into it. Spirit, what messages do you have for Leo for the month of July? Two cards flew out. Spirit, what messages do you have for Leo for the month of July? Leo, you could have a cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, and they feelings. Leo, I mean, it don't have to be a cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Um, with all this water, um, this person is just in their feelings. I feel like somebody is washing their hands with this situation, Leo. Um, this, I mean, this could be a cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or they just in their feelings. I feel like Leo... Whoever this person is, they feel they feel maybe left out by you. They feel left out. It's something. Let me see. I feel like this person they be in their head a lot. So Leo, if this is a a friend or like a lover. They be overthinking stuff, too, because it's like, Leo, you could tell this person, um, hey, hey, bro, hey, hey, sis, hey, I'm at work, let me call you back when I'm done, and see if you don't call this person back. This person, they be overthinking, like, so is Leo, did they find somebody else? Leo, so do they have a new friend, a new best friend now? That's why they didn't call me back. But, Leo, the reason why you didn't call this person back, because it's like you had to, shit, you still at work. <laughs> you still at work. Or when you had got off of work, you went straight to the grocery store because you knew you was cooking because the kids was blowing you up. It, it's nothing personal. Leo, I feel like whatever you're doing, it's nothing personal, but it's a person. They taking this to heart. And they, I feel like they overthinking. Like they in their mind about this relationship. So whether this is a relationship with your friend or a relationship with your husband, wife, girlfriend, or boyfriend, or like a, a coworker that you call a friend or something like that. They feel like you, um, something is up with Leo. But the T is that I feel like you really taking care of your business like when it comes to your family and shit making sure you you cooking dinner when you get off um <laughs> making sure things at work is in order before you clock out it's like that's what your mind is focused on but somebody feel neglected or they they feel like you don't care for them anymore another mess i'm getting leo I feel like for the longest, so this is like another message. Leo, I feel like somebody could have been like still holding on to your energy or like still trying to hold on to you. Um, but I feel like in the month of July, they're going to have a mindset like, you know what, fuck it. You know, it is what it is. Or, you know, whenever Leo have time, they'll come back around. Or if they don't, you know... Every every person have this season, have their season in your life. I feel like somebody, it was like wishful thinking. So, Leo, if this is like an old lover, an old friend, like an old co-worker. Say this is an old co-worker. 
and Leo, you became friends with this person, but you ended up quitting. You ended up resigning and you worked somewhere else. But Leo, how you looked at your old coworker, you looked at them like, I mean, yeah, they cool and all, but they just the uh, they was just a coworker. Meanwhile, Leo, this person, they actually looked at you as one of their friends. <laughs> right? They actually looked at you as one of they one of their good friends. So Leo, say you went to like a whole nother company and basically it's like you starting this brand new chapter in your life to where you don't even care to associate with the people that you used to work with. But this person in particular, they've been waiting. Okay, you know, I'm not going to bother Leo right now because I know they just moved. I know they just, they, I know they was moving into another house or another apartment. Then I know they had ended up resigning. So I'm not going to bother them right now. I'm going to just wait till they hit me up. And whoever this person is, they were still like still holding on to your energy, Leo. I'm using this story for example, but it's something like in the month of July, somebody's gonna like release you. But I feel like for the longest, this person was still trying to hold on to you, or this person had like wishful thinking, like, you know, eventually Leo will come back around. Eventually, they will text me. Eventually, we'll hang out again. But I feel like in the month of July, this person, like, you know what? Fuck it. You know, obviously, they wasn't my friend anyway. Or the way I, clearly, the way I felt about Leo, Leo didn't feel that way about me. So, good Britons. That's the energy I, I, I'm picking up on, Leo. Leo, be aware of this. Um, I, I feel like people are people are wondering, like, I feel like people are wondering or people are questioning, like, what you do for a living or how much money you make. Because we have the judgment with the nine of pentacles. And I just feel like, man, Leo looking good. Leo dressing better, looking better. What the fuck they do for work? And then, you know, how much money, I, I wonder how much, are they on salary? Do they get paid hourly or some shit? Lee, I feel like people are judging you. But they judging you by your appearance and, like, how you carry yourself. I heard what type of car you drive. Something about what type of car you drive, too. Like, when people see the type of car you drive, they wonder, like, hmm... I wonder how much they make. Yeah, Leo. So back to the story I was telling y'all about how a person was still like holding on to your energy. This person feel like, you know, this is the ultimate betrayal. Like I waited for Leo. I thought Leo was my friend. Um, Leo said this is a, 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 a ex-lover of yours. They thought y'all was going to get back together. And this person, Leo, I feel like somebody waited on you. They will, they will come back around. I'm not going to date nobody else. I'm not going to, um, I'm not going to befriend another person at work. Because I already made my friend, which was Leo. I don't need, I don't need to be cool with nobody else. I got Leo. But with this ten of swords out here, this is a life lesson for somebody. I have this out here too, with the ten of swords with the temperance. Somebody was supposed to learn some type of lesson from whatever situation somebody thought they had with you, Leo. I feel like two people were, was on two totally different pages. One person, like, said these are co-workers. Yeah, it's like one person, man, y'all just my co-workers. You know, I got to talk to y'all. I see y'all every day. But the other person feel like, yeah, we work together, but they really my friend. They really my friend. And it's some type of life lesson that they, they need to learn. Like, the life lesson could be, like, you know, everybody ain't your friend. <laughs> some shit, right? Uh, you know, it's something like this going on. I'm more picking up on this other person's energy, Leo. 
This could be a Cancer Scorpio Pisces, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, uh, Sagittarius person. But, yeah, I, I feel like somebody, this is going to be a hard, this going to be hard for this person to, like, release you too. They're going to end up releasing you, Leo. I heard on your balls. Leo, I feel like somebody just on your balls. Riding your clit on your balls or something. But I'm picking up, like, energetically, this person was still, like, fiending for you or still considering you as their friend or something. But something is definitely over, Leo. Um, and it's going to be hard for this person to accept this. But I feel like this is some type of lesson that somebody had to learn. They're supposed to learn something from this situation. But, Leo, I feel like this is more for the other person, not you. And then, I mean, another way I can read this, Leo, if somebody going through some type of heartbreak, um, betrayal or something like that, I feel like you're going to bounce back from this. Leo, be aware. I see some betrayal going on. Leo, be aware. I feel like somebody be talking about you behind your back, too. Leo, I feel like somebody, they be talking about, like, like they talk about how you dress. I mean, these could be males, but I'm strongly picking up like females. Females gossiping. I have this out here too. But Leo, so for this message, this other message I'm picking up on, I feel like you're going to find this information out. You're going to find out like, People or a person been saying stuff about you. And then another message I'm getting, Leo, be aware of, of surrounding yourself around people that you're smarter than. People that you're smarter than. People that you look better than. Uh, <laughs> people that's below you. Be aware of, like, surrounding yourself around these types of people, Leo. That has been your reading. Thank you. Bye-bye.